Valsogard Enterprise. Improving everything. In this lesson, I'm going to show you how to add a GitHub notification bot to your Discord server or project channel. Okay, so here I have just an empty Unreal Engine project based on the third person. Literally nothing uh, added or changed. And I have my new Discord server. And uh, I'm going to create a channel. But before that, I also want to show you here's my GitHub uh, repository for the project itself. And now I'm going to show you the whole process. And also I have source tree, which is Git graphics user interface, but it's not that important for the time being. Anyway, um, uh, let's go through the steps. So first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to create a channel in my uh, Discord server. Um, let's call it example project doesn't really matter. And let's set it to private. By the way, you probably already have your uh, project uh, project Discord channel. But anyway, this is how you create a uh, channel on Discord. And now I gotta go to this cog uh, icon, click on it, which says edit channel, and then go to integrations. And then look over here for webhooks. So now I'm gonna click on create webhook. And uh, I'm gonna name it uh, GitHub bot. The name doesn't really matter. You can label it uh, whatever you like, but I do like to keep this uh, standard like a GitHub bot. Anyway, um, copy webhook URL and save changes. Now you can escape or exit from uh, Discord. And now I'm gonna go to my uh, GitHub repository, go to settings, go to webhooks, add webhook. Okay, I have to type in my password. This is probably going to be something that you would have to do yourself as well. It always asks for a password. Anyway, uh, now we are inside webhooks panel. And now what I have to do is paste the webhook link that I copied uh, just a couple of uh, seconds ago. And now important thing, you need to add slash GitHub like this. So this is the thing, this is the part that you need to add. So let me show you again. Paste the GitHub, sorry, paste the webhook link itself slash github that's it now content type uh choose application slash json secret leave this empty now which events would you like to trigger uh, this webhook um you can select uh, just the push event send me everything so this is going to literally notify uh, and the push notifications about anything that is happening with the repository itself or you can choose this option let me let me select individual events and you have a bunch of options that you can choose from so well if you, if you feel like customizing the settings uh, feel free to uh, explore this area as well but for the time being what i would suggest is to send me everything or go by the first option um i think send me everything uh, is uh, is just fine by default and let's add webhook okay uh now you can see this green check mark that basically says that the webhook is uh tested and it's uh, working and now let's test it in uh, actual practice shall we okay so like i said i have my uh, empty project and it is literally sitting on my desktop so i have my uh, uh, repository here with the uh, unreal engine project itself and uh, since i have no commits whatsoever as of right now well, I'm going to 
make some commits, make some changes to the project itself. So I'm gonna select these core files and I'm going to add them. I'm going I'm going to stage them and I'm gonna write uh, uh, the commit message. I'm adding core files. I think that's more than enough for the time being. Now I'm gonna click on commit and I'm gonna open terminal and type in git push. And uh, as you can see, we have our message over here, which basically says that something has happened. New commit, adding core files. And uh, let's do another one. So let me make some space on my uh, monitor, on my main screen. And uh, let's make it parallel like this. So I'm gonna add a couple of more files. Um, let's let's pick this file for example. Um, this is the default third person map. Adding the default third person template map. Um, well, more more than enough. And uh, this is my commit message. I'm more than happy with it. And I'm gonna click on commit again. And I'm gonna go back to terminal and I'm just gonna repeat uh, the git push command and press enter. Pay attention to the right corner of our screen. There you go, there you can see the message literally took like a second or two to appear. And that's it, that's how you add the uh, GitHub notification uh, bots to your Discord server or project channels. I think this is something that uh, very helps with uh, productivity, so uh, feel free to use it whenever you think it's uh, it makes sense. And that's it for this lesson, thank you for watching.